Hola, como estas? Today I'm super duper excited, but also very nervous because I'm gonna be visiting Deep Dive Dubai. Deep Dive Dubai is the deepest swimming pool in the world. It's actually 60 meters deep, which is approximately like 196.9 feet. That's insane. Before I go, and I feel like I, I'm not in the right shape. I feel like I need to do some exercises. One, two, three, four. I did it! Now I'm stuck. Um. Okay, you know what? Let's just go face my fear. I'm pretty sure if I leave this car, there's gonna be a trail of poop because I'm so nervous right now. It would be worse if it was the ocean, you know. At least it's a pool full of water and no creatures or animals, just water. Here's me approaching the door, super duper nervous. I was scared, but I knew for a fact that I was gonna do it anyway. But obviously it's normal to be quite nervous because fear of the unknown. Oh my gosh, you literally can't even <laughs> see the bottom of the pool. Okay, boy, actually you're gonna go inside of me. Okay, I like it. Mm -hmm. Good luck, there's chef. I'm going to attempt to play chess, even though I don't actually even know how to play chess. And um, look, there's a, there's a motorbike and a car. That's where I'm gonna get my driver's license for the first time. I'm gonna drive in the pool. Yep. Hi, are you Ruby? Yeah. Hi, Ruby, I'm Alma. I'll be your instructor and guide today. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Are you excited? Yeah. <laughs> are you nervous? Yeah. It's normal to be nervous. Okay, from here, I'm going to take you to the change room. We will be uh, I'm looking at uh, your equipment that you're gonna be using today. And after that, we'll do a briefing at the pool deck and we'll start uh, with our experience. Okay. Okay. Okay, guys. I'm in the famous pool area. I've seen this a lot on TikTok. That's the deep pool right there. It doesn't look deep, but it is deep. As I was going deeper and deeper into this swimming pool, my ears started to hurt really bad. And this was because of the pressure and I wasn't equalizing my ears properly. So we had to go all the way back up to the surface and then we had to go down again slowly just so my ears could come back to the normal pressure. As I was swimming in the deepest pool in the world, I felt really free. I never imagined the feeling that it gave me. It was absolutely amazing. I can now relate to Under the Sea by Sebastian in The Little Mermaid because honestly, being underwater is just a completely different world to being on land. Okay, here I am in my suit. Here's my box with my name on it, with everything I need to put on. Is this gonna be easy? Let's see. I'm all kitted up. Feels like I'm carrying Bonnie on my back. We're about to go into the water. Here's me. Entering the water, heart going 50 miles per hour while trying to keep my ears at the right pressure so I don't die and they don't explode. You can tell I look nervous, my gosh. Here I am on a motorbike, not knowing what I'm doing at all. Literally. Here's me, I finally found my dream boyfriend, someone who won't leave me because they're stuck on the floor. There's me playing pool, obviously cheating. I actually do know how to play pool. I'm not short in real life, I'm five foot six. Here's me trying to do like one of those really cool poses. You know how those men hold on to the, the lamppost and they like hold themselves up. Driving my first car, blasting Olivia Rodrigo driver's license. Yes, I'm the first person to drive underwater. Where are all the cute boys at? Where's my boyfriend? Let me try and find him. Boyfriend, where are you? Nope, he's not there. You know what, forget, forget about my boyfriend. I've got ice cream. Ice cream, do you want to be my new lover? Sorry, that's not actually how I eat. What? Oh, I might have ate a bit too much ice cream. Wait, why are you guys watching? Kind of creepy. Hmm. Look, I'm gonna be the next Ronaldo. Look, 
look at that skull. Woo! I suck at football. <sighs> look how cool this is. Just chilling on the edge of a cliff, 60 meters deep. If I fall, I'm dead. I'm joking, I'm not. I sure might. Wait, where's Granny? Granny, you there? All right, don't have to be so rude about it. Goodness gracious me. I love you guys. Okay, here's me attempting to play chess. I felt so silly because my instructor was playing with me afterwards and I was just sitting there like, what the heck do I do? Someone please come and teach me chess. Here is me trying to impersonate a 42 year old mum Karen who's frantically looking for their child. Like, I, I feel like this is what a 42 year old Karen would look like trying to find their child in the supermarket. If I'm wrong, let me know how they would look in the comments. I actually don't know what this is at all. I thought it was an exercise bike, but unless this is from the future, I'm not sure what it is. Gotta get that dough. Gotta get my OnlyFans money. Oh, I'm joking. I, I don't have an OnlyFans. But I do need some money. Maybe I'll just take it out of Granny's account. <laughs> I'm gonna be rich because it's all about the money, money, money. That's not, that's a penny. What am I gonna do with a penny? This part was actually super duper cool. The bubbles were going on the roof and they felt, I mean, they just felt normal, but it was beautiful to look at. Hey, have you guys subscribed yet? If you haven't, hit that subscribe button while you watch me looking like an old lady trying to get up on the sofa. I finally did it. And now I'm going down. Awkward. My gosh, I was looking down. This is when I first got into the water and I was so scared because I could see the big hole and I was pooing myself. This was me trying to read a newspaper or magazine, but like, I don't know how you're supposed to do that. Technology nowadays, oh, that silly little thing fell. It really annoyed me. I've got no clue where I am. Great filming, Ruby. I'm having my hot chocolate and my croissant because I'm absolutely starving and it's surreal that I was in there. Experience a thousand hour fountain. I enjoyed it so much and if you're in Dubai, make sure you check it out because it's super fun. Fun. I'm so proud of you, Ruby. Well done. I'll see you next time, guys.